Hey guys, what's up? It's Alex here. And today I'm gonna to show you how to start your car when your key fob battery is dead in your Subaru. So today we're looking at a 2019 Subaru Outback, but this should be the same across the board for your Subaru as long as it has the keyless access. So a question that I get all the time is, how do you start your car when your key fob battery dies? And so I'm gonna show you how to do that today. Uh, the battery in this key fob is not dead, but I'm gonna show you how to actually disable it if you ever wanted to put it in sleep mode. So that way it's not communicating with the vehicle. Um, so it won't allow you to unlock the car or the trunk or anything like that or the gas tank. Uh, door, but uh, there is a way to get into the car manually and also to start the car without the key fob battery being charged. If you guys watch this video and get value out of it, please be sure to smash the like button. That really helps me out. And also, if you guys have any questions, leave them down in the comment section below. And as always, subscribe if you like seeing super related videos. So first, what I'm going to do is lock the car. And we're gonna go ahead and put it in sleep mode because the battery is still good in this one. And the way you do that is by clicking this, the lock button and holding, and then double clicking the Subaru unlock button, the Subaru logo at the same time. So I'm gonna try to do this with one hand. We'll see how well that works. We're gonna click and double click. And that should light up, the little red light here should light up four times to tell you it's in sleep mode and to check. We'll go up to the car. It's not unlocking even though the key is in my pocket because this proximity sensor is not communicating with the key fob. So what you do when your key fob battery is dead is you press this little button and you pull that key out. So now we're gonna use this key manually to unlock So of course the alarm will go off when your car is locked and the alarm is set. So be aware of that. But now whenever you get into the car, you're going to try to start it and it's gonna say access key not detected. So what you're going to do, even if the key fob battery is dead, you just stick it up to there and it's gonna recognize the key, even with it dead or in sleep mode. So that's how you start your car if your key fob battery dies. If you guys have any more Subaru related questions, then please leave them down in the comment section below and I'll be happy to help you. As always, hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you in the next one.